The News Edge working breaking news this Friday night. At least three occupied D.C. protesters hit by a car. Police say the driver kept going before he was stopped. Roz Plater working this one tonight. Roz, what do you know? Well, Brian, pretty chaotic scene as you can imagine down there with all of this going on. Let's take a live a picture right now from the scene where investigators are still on the scene, scene rather, trying to figure out why all this happened. Now, it all started as a group of protesters from Occupy D.C. had surrounded the convention center. They were there to confront folks who were part of a conference called Defending the Dream, held by the Americans for Prosperity. Now, we can, if we can go to the video, we can show you a witness on the scene took a photo of one of the victims being loaded onto a stretcher. Our Fox 5 photographer, Craig Little, was covering that protest when all of this happened. He says just before 10 o'clock tonight, one of the protesters ran up to the group shouting, we need a medic, we need a medic. Our photographer ran to see what was happening and saw a man down at 7th and K Streets Northwest. Then about a block away at 7th and Massachusetts Avenue, he spotted a silver car surrounded by protesters who were shouting, shame on you, shame on you, you hit people. A man was sitting behind the wheel of that car. Now, D.C. police tell us at least three Occupy D.C. protesters have been hit by a car, that that happened at 7th and K Streets Northwest. Police say the driver, the car hit the first group, then kept driving and hit a third person before it stopped. At least two people have been taken to the hospital. One person is in custody, though it's not clear right now if that person is the driver or a protester. Uh, these details are coming in. It's a developing story. We'll get more to you in the newscast as we find out more from this scene. Brian? Right, Roz, just let us know. We'll come right back to you.